Thank you. The lifting of the immunity is very clearly directed towards the HDP members and the attention is also very clear behind that. It's to silence the HDP group and even the HDP party. This is entirely undemocratic. It criminalizes a whole democratic party representing a sizable part of the population, a sizable part of the voters even. And it's also not just Kurds who voted for HDP. It was a lot of people who believed in a different future for Turkey. It was a lot of people who were protesting for better lives, for human rights, for freedom of expression, for all those things that we are saying we're trying to stand for. So we need to support those people. It is a great disgrace that the Kurdish conflict is now out again in the open. And it's also a huge pity because Erdogan himself was on the best way to find a sustainable solution. And now we're back to square one. Hundreds of civilians have died, houses are being bombed, and this is no way how you can fight terrorism, quite the opposite. It is a great loss, the lost peace process, I really have to say. And the European Union and also the member states themselves need to be very strong in their reaction. We have to be clear about the values we're trying to represent. We should not be silent when those who are trying to speak up are being silenced. We have made many mistakes in the past as the European Union and also the member states. We have actually made Erdogan grow stronger on our rejection. We should not make those mistakes. We should support the people who are defending the same values as us. Then we can go work for a better Turkey. Thank you.